Troy, so good to see you, man. You too, champ. Your big victory over Seth at WrestleMania has Miz in the most cheerful mood. Believe me, the whole team is delighted with you. Sarcasm for sarcasm. I dig it. What do you and our must-see general manager have for me now? A live interview on The Bump that you're already running late for. And believe me, you don't want to miss this. Oh, I won't. I've never been more eager to tell the WWE Universe all about the Miz's stellar leadership. Great! There's a car waiting outside. It's not a limo or an SUV. It's actually a compact rental car that you'll be driving yourself. And you owe us $74.38. And it will actually be more than that if you don't fill up the gas before you return it. Wow. You guys really know how to treat your champions. Thanks, Troy. Some say the story was finally completed on night two of WrestleMania when Cody Rhodes won the World Heavyweight Championship at last. But it felt like a beginning to me, Kayla. I agree, Byron. But our guest at this time is also in the midst of an incredible story. Please welcome the man who won the main event on night one, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion. Welcome, champ. Huge night for you at WrestleMania. Thanks, Byron. First, congratulations to Cody. He's been in the hunt for a long time. From one champ to another, here's to you. As Cody begins his championship journey, yours is becoming a marathon. I remember right after you won the WWE Universal title, Roman Reigns joked that you wouldn't last a month. Now it is day 666, and ooh, uh, hope that's not bad luck for your upcoming match. Wait, do you know something I don't? What match? Uh, yes, it wasn't meant to come out that way, but we do have some significant news to share on that front. Way to blow our big reveal, Byron. Anyway, Miz gave us the exclusive on your next championship defense. Well, I'm here. Might as well say it. Before I do, just remember we're only the messengers. This is straight from The Miz. You will defend the undisputed WWE Universal Championship against five other superstars in an Elimination Chamber match. I think Miz's words were actually, I'll put the toughest opponents from his past inside a cage and see if he's lucky enough to survive. Ha 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 ha. So, uh, thoughts? I'm not phased. Sure, this will be one of the greatest tests of my reign in the Elimination Chamber. And Miz can bring out all the heavy hitters he wants. But I'm not going to need luck. Luck isn't going to enter the picture. They used to call me the Dark Horse. But now the WWE Universe knows that I am a workhorse. I'm going to out-hustle every man in the chamber, and I'm going to walk out still the undisputed WWE Universal Champion because Miz sets him up, and I knock him down. So, anything else you want to cover? Uh, I think you made your point. Look at the smile. You look entirely too happy to be a general manager. I finally got the champion I should have had for quite some time. Cody? Good for him. Good for the business. He's an amazing talent carrying quite the legacy. I'm proud of him. I get your relief. The World Heavyweight title gets passed around so much over on Raw that it must have been hard to keep track. Hopefully Cody can hang on to it for a while. Hopefully you can hold on to the WWE Universal Championship through the Elimination Chamber tonight. Miz has assembled quite the rogues gallery. Yeah, consisting mostly of guys I already beat. Overconfidence can blind one to unseen threats. 
I'm coming up on two years as WWE Universal Champion, Regal. I think I've earned a little confidence at this point. Well, how you've changed. It would be interesting. What? If you get through the Elimination Chamber, perhaps Miz and I should start a conversation about the match everyone expected on your first night as champion. You versus Cody Rhodes. The match everyone expected me to lose? Bring it on. Wonder who the odds would favor this time. A fine question indeed. One that's been hanging over my head for a long time. I'm thinking maybe you're right. And it's time we answered it. Maybe. But we'll talk more later. If you can survive tonight. Good luck. Five top challengers are all vying for the WWE Universal Championship. And not just any challengers, mind you. Some of them have revenge on their mind. You said it, Cole. Beating a man once takes skill. Beating a man twice takes guts. Beating them in an elimination chamber takes... Well, I just don't know if the champ has what it takes. Well, I'm eager to see what the champ is made of tonight in this daunting title defense. Powerbomb! The champ probably hoping that emphatic attacks like that will keep them in control here. He gets back into the ring. Oh, and a discus clothesline. Took their head off. to turn this around and quick. Shoulders down. Now it's Paul. Oh my, how in the world did he kick out of that? He is certainly sending a message, getting his shoulder up before two. Thunderous right hand. Close line. Setting it up. Boom. Oh man. Set freaking Rollins. Joins the fun and looks to release a firestorm of brutality. Caught with a neck breaker. Able to reverse that one. Such an underhanded tactic there. There was no issue with that attack. Hey, sometimes desperate times call for desperate measures. Who are we to judge? Sent into the corner. Oh, man! Just like that, Paul finds a counter. That was vicious. The champ has his one in hand now. It's time that he stops the count, but why? There are nasty intentions that still need to be delivered. It's down. No, Tyler still hangs in the balance. What do you have to do to put this guy in the Sharp elbow to the gut turns that one around. Oh, gut punch. Nasty. out. Wow, that is some impressive strength. Flying forward. Spear! Spear! A championship! 
championship level move. Here we go. Drew McIntyre has been all oh, that should do it right there. Kick it out in time. This is going to come down to who wants it more. to the trachea. He went right into that turbo. He's one step ahead there. Does he get him here? Now looking at Kane. And the champ can't keep the shoulders down. Wow. Foot to the belly. Bruising attack to the stomach. Pulls the trigger. A knee of the revolution style by Rollins. The champ kicks out with authority. Not quite enough to put him away. Out of the ring and on the chamber floor now. Oh no, what's this all about? He's making the climb. He's making the climb. The climb to what? Don't do it. Oh no. He's putting your body on the line. Was trying to make a big splash with that, but there was no water in the pool. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. No one can. Spin! The champ will stay champ. Shoulders down. Makes the cover. He may get the three count right here. This is it. Kicks out. Really had less than a second to stay alive there. Power. I think the champ's got it. Great officiating. As the ref noticed, he was on the ropes. This could do it! Look at the ref got hit hard there. A kick out before one by the challenger. Amazing. But back to Kamura. The Kamura! Kamura lock applied. Will they tap? It's not embarrassing to tap out. And, and look at this. Fight got taken straight to McIntyre there. On the outside now, one of the most dangerous places to be in the elimination chamber. Oh! Lands a kick to the gut. Dear, this doesn't look good. Ouch. That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. Uh-oh. Stunner! Gonna see a new champ. Makes a cover. A kick out. The champion. Now that is why they're the champ. So many combinations to duke it out here in the chamber. Leaving the ring now to explore the chamber. Owens was scouted there. Oh. Kick to the gut. Ooh, brutal form. No, oh, this is gonna hurt. The dominant. Chamber. This could still go any way. Boom. Into a neck breaker. Huge oh. power bomb. Comes back into the ring. Spear. Another one bites the dust to the chin. Top of the foot. Boom! Placing them right where they want. From the middle rope into the stump. Good night. We can have a new champion. From the chaos, now the final two 
combatants emerge. Who will conquer the Elimination Chamber? On the outside now. No place is safe in the Elimination Chamber, but the outside is especially dangerous. Great strength being shown here. Powerbomb! The challenger's hopes are slipping away. Yeah, this match has not been kind to him. Yeah, all the architect's designs seem to be going astray. Got to figure out a new plan quick. Reigns down an elbow in retaliation. Oh, man! Punch right in the head. Oh, I had that well scouted. Denied with an elbow. He steps foot in the ring again. Going way up high. Uh-oh. I don't like the looks of this, guys. Oh, no! Good God, good God, that does it, that'll do it! How the hell did that just happen? Change. I mean, you got to think he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Seth retaliates. Leaving the ring now to explore the chamber. He takes control. Can it be? Will the rain continue? Cover! The champion retains. Here is your winner. And still, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Mike. The WWE Universal Champion has outlasted the toughest opponents from his past. But now, what lies ahead? He's pretty much defeated everyone. What lies ahead is the champion who has reigned longer than the Dark Horse, and that's Gunther. It's time we see those two face off. I just survived the toughest opponents from my past in the Elimination Chamber. So now what? Do I take some time off? Maybe hit the golf course? Rest up and recover? Nah, I don't think so. See, there's one other superstar in WWE who's actually been champion longer than I have. And I've been hearing rumblings for a long time that he deserves what I have. That somehow he's more worthy than me. I'm talking about you, Gunther. I'm ready to quiet all the doubters once again. You think you deserve what I have? Then come and try to take it. Don't forget to subscribe.